I want to share with you one of the great many resources uh, available for Jazz Ed, and this one is really huge. It covers a lot of ground. Here it is, the Jazz Handbook. This is free. It's free. Did I say it's free? It's it's free. <laughs> you can get on Jamie Ambersoll's website and look where it says free jazz. Click it and you'll see the Jazz Handbook. Everything is PDF, so you can download this whole thing. But don't let this size fool you. See that? There is a boom. There's more in this book than you think. If you're creative as a teacher, you can use this as a text for a year. Easy. Easy. Uh, and uh, I think the birth of this book is um, not even a book. Uh, it's uh, it, it sounds like when you read through it that it was something where Jamie might have said to all the guys who taught for him at his camps. I taught at his camp for about 15 years. Uh, all improvisation. Great. Great. Everybody who taught probably handed in something. Piano player handed in voicings. Uh, someone handed in something about articulation. Someone else handed this in. And they put this together, and this is what it is. Everybody gets one of these. I have tons of these at, at school. All of my students get this. Uh, they all have it in their folders. I'll go through it really quick. I mean, I've done an hour clinic just on this and what you can do with it. If you're a student and you want the information, just get it. If you don't at least look at this online, you're crazy. It's free. It's right there. Well, you shouldn't say crazy. It's not politically correct. So anyway, what you want to do is check this out. Uh, if you're a teacher and you can be, you're inventive with your techniques. This, this can become every two. Uh, I'm sorry, every page can be a project. It's really great. So just real quick, uh, knowing that, and of course you know Jamie Ambersoll. He doesn't need my help. Jamie has so many great things out. The play-alongs are, we all know about those. They're great, especially if you, you're specific in what you want to learn. You want to learn bird tunes? You get the bird play along. You want to learn Cole Porter tunes? Get the Cole Porter play along. Uh, Joe Bean tunes? There's a Joe Bean. Right now, I know he has well over 120 play alongs. But check out Jamie. He's like, he's the 95% uh, of the stuff that's out it, for Jazz Ed. Jamie has it in his catalog. But anyway, I'm just going to go through this real fast because it's, if, if you don't know about it, he, Jamie talks about soloing. He has some ideas about that. Jamie goes through this page. Boom! This is a this is a month's worth of work right here. He lists great players based on instrument. You'll see clarinet, maybe 25 players. Tenor sax, maybe 60 players. Piano, maybe 60 players. Big band, scat singing, violin, harmonica. He lists the instruments and who plays them. And the reason why this is important. Because the generation that knew a lot of these people are now aging, and the new generation coming in, they would like to know who to listen to. They don't know a lot of these players, so they need to see them. So that's what's great about this. You couple this with YouTube, where uh, I had a student who played violin. We looked at some players. She got one on YouTube. She saw, oh my gosh, this is great. She started to find her own players. This is great. This page alone is, is everything. If you're smart and you use it that way. Uh, then he gives you a list of Classic recordings, uh, uh, Sidewinder, Lee Morgan, uh, uh, you know, all the classics, uh, they're listed right here. Because some people don't know what the classic recordings are. And all that information's here. Uh, digital way of going through a tune. You get a chord, play the root. Play the root and the third. Play the root and the third and the fifth. Play the first five notes of the scale. Play the first uh, one, three, five, six of every chord. Then go through the tune, play one, three, five, seven. Then go through the tune, play one, three, five, seven, nine. So it's a digital way of going through a tune. It's good. It's great. It, one page. Boom. Not even one page, half a page. So uh, songs that everybody knows. In other words, common ground tunes. If you play... Uh, you want to be a jazz player and you go to Alaska, there's a core group of tunes that the jazz players up there will know. Go to Milwaukee, go to New York, go to Miami, go to Texas. If you get around jazz players, we all know a certain core group of tunes. He gives you one list. You can make you can make a hundred lists, uh, but this is a healthy list that he has. 
uh, it gives you a digital readout of how scales are constructed. This is huge. It's done by number, not by key. So a mixolydian would be one, two, three, four, five, six, flat seven. Now you just apply that to a key. So that's a digital way of looking at it. One page on that. Scale syllabi. It's a whole other thing right here. Oh my God, nomenclature. I got. <laughs> I have to. Nomenclature is extremely confusing. Uh, if you don't realize that nomenclature hasn't settled down yet, uh, you'll see a lot of different names for the same chord. And you will think, if you don't know, or someone hasn't told you, or if you were like me when I was learning, I didn't know, you can see about five or six, oh, even more, ways of naming the same chord. So C major could be C, just C. Well, how do you know C means a whole scale? Nobody tells you. You screw it up, and that's how you find out. You might see C with a capital M, C with an M-A, C with a capital M-A. You may uh, notice C with an M-A-J. You may see C M-A-J-7. You may see C with a capital M with a 7 next to it. You may see C with a capital M with a 9 next to it. You may see C with a triangle. Oh, that, that one. <laughs> that really helped clear things up. So there could be 15 ways of calling a C major 7 chord a C major 7 chord. And it's all confusing, and I must spend a month, well, more like a week, but a month correcting it. It takes me a week to explain this page. And then, for weeks later, I'm still correcting it because it's so confusing. So anyway, he puts it down on one page. This you can't be. Talks about dominant chords. Oh, boy. And he shows you, he writes out all the digital drills. He lists all the majors and the Dorians and the Mixolydians and the diminished and the whole tones and the altered dominant scale and bass clef and treble. All right here to see, so you have no problem. Uh, interval chart. Uh, oh gosh. Mode, circle of fifths, circle of fourths. Um, oh, it goes on and on and on, and it's free. You have to have articulation exercises. Uh, the blue scale. This is huge for the blue scalers. Blue scales in all keys and treble, blue scale in all keys and bass clef. This thing is... What's big about this book, not only does, oh, well, yeah, not only does it have the information in it, if you're creative, like I said earlier, you can get any one of these devices, turn it into a whole lecture. This, if you were going to give a clinic and you could expand upon these, this is about, about 15 different clinics in this book. Anyway... Chord substitutions, uh, different ways. What does he list? 17, is that 17? Yeah. 17 ways to harmonize F blues. Like one isn't enough. All right? He talks about bebop scales, great bebop players, uh, transposition, a couple of Charlie Parker stories. There's some tests in the back that uh, Jamie uses to place people at the camps. But they're great. They're great for exercising. We could play it as a game. I've used it as a game at my school. Um, and uh, gives you some two fives to put in every key, piano voicings, two note voicings, three note voicings, four note voicings. This book, lit, it's a book lit, is crazy good. Once again, if you're inventive as a teacher, you can't beat it, and it's free. So check out Jamie's stuff. Of course, uh, Jamie has a <laughs> it's an understatement to say that Jamie has more stuff than this. Jamie is check out Jamie's stuff, but this you need to know about, because it's free, and Jamie's just take it, take it and use it Jazz Handbook by Jamie Ambersole, check out Jamie, great